Good evening, everybody. Uh, my name is Mr. McKay, and I'm the band director here at Dodgeland. Thank you all for coming out tonight. Thanks for coming back if you went to the choir concert yesterday. Um, we are going to start with our sixth grade band, these guys. Okay. We're going to start with two songs. I will let the kids introduce the songs this year. Jingle Bells is one of the most popular Christmas tunes ever written. A, a little known fact is that uh, it was originally written for Thanksgiving and was titled One Horse Open Sleigh. <laughs> Magma is a bold and aggressive composition for the youngest of students. It uses only the first of six notes learned in the most beginning band methods, B flat to G. The key of the piece is C minor and is un an unusually key for young bands.
This is going to be our seventh, eighth grade band. And again, I will have the students introduce the pieces this time. Published in 1901, The Old Man was the oldest example of songs to help teach counting. This song was used as a teaching song in our band's method book. Is modest ranges and easy phrases allow students to produce their finest tone quality with a heavy emphasis on woodwinds. We hope to showcase our hard work for you. Please enjoy our, our performance of Song for Friends by Larry Dan. We're going to get started in just a second after we play a tuning note. Um, this is a Trojan jazz band. This is a curricular, so in-school jazz band, which is pretty cool. Um, most of these students are new. We have three returning students from last year, which means this band is pretty young, uh, and they're adapting to the style well. We're going to start out with two familiar tunes. It's going to be Linus and Lucy first, um, with our Braxton Soldner is going to be soloing on that one. Uh, and then the next one is going to be Don't Fear the Reaper. Thank you. 
Our next song is going to be Pass the Hot Sauce. Pass the Hot Sauce ignites an infectious hot Latin groove from the downbeat, utilizing authentic and traditional rhythms and repetition. This chart allows young bands and audience members to experience the rhythmic energy of Soul Calypso. Uh, before I send the jazz band kids off, I would like to say thank you to Nathan Johnson, our drum set player and our jazz trumpeter, who told me that he wanted to play trumpet this year. Uh, he is graduating a semester, so we will be losing him after this uh, cycle. So this is the last band's concert ever. Um, thank you for all your hard work. Hello. We are going to switch to our high school concert band now. Um, the first piece will be introduced by our band director, vice president, Adam Shipley. Johan Pachelbel, Canon in D, has long, has long been one of the most popular classical pieces and has already been connected to holidays through various settings of the piece. Larry Clark took this one step further and integrated pieces of carols like Hark the Herald, Angels Sing, and the First Noel. This is f for a refreshing newish addition to holiday concert rep.
Percy Granger's, Granger's, Granger's masterwork for band, Lincolnshire Posey, was composed in 1937 and includes unique and striking settings of English folk melodies. The sixth and final movement in this lively dance, The Lost Lady Found, and has been arranged for young players. The folk song tells of a young woman stolen away and missing for years. Her uncle is accused of doing away with her to gain her fortune and is sent to prison. Her sweetheart, however, searches far and wide and eventually finds the woman and brings her back home just in time to rescue her uncle from being hung. Here is a short segment of the original song. Then straight from the gallows they led him away, the bells they did ring and the music did play. Every house in the valley with mirth did resound as soon as they heard the lost lady was found. Our last song for tonight is going to be Homeward Bound. Homeward Bound is one of the most popular and widely performed contemporary choral pieces of all time. This heartfelt piece is an elegant in its simplicity and it has touched thousands of musicians and their audiences with its warm and sincerity. Additionally, it has become the anthem for many soldiers returning home from foreign wars. On behalf of the Dodgeland Band, we would like to thank you all for coming. Please travel safely and have a wonderful holiday break. And a special thanks to Noah McKay for making this all possible. So give him a